Hey folks, I just wanted to show you this, um, I don't know if you want to call it a trick or a workaround or uh, it, what it is, it's a way to get past a chat bot uh, if you need to. Like, um, for instance, uh, if, you're, um, if you're in Pennsylvania right now, I don't know if you know a little bit about Pennsylvania, but um, there's a lot of unemployment in Pennsylvania right now. So uh, a lot of people that I know, a lot of my friends, they've... Uh, They've needed to, to use, they needed to get in touch with uh, the people at uh, the Unemployment uh, Compensation Department of Labor and Industry in Pennsylvania. And uh, so if you go to the website, type in PA Unemployment, obviously on Yahoo, click the link. Now, when you get to the website, make sure that there's a lock symbol here that's locked and not unlocked, just uh, for your own security. Okay, and then go ahead and close the search window just in case because you don't want anybody uh, getting any of your private information here. So on this website, uh, if you need to talk to a person about something that's gone wrong with your account or if you have a question about like, you know, I don't know how to file and all this stuff and the things that aren't in the frequently asked questions aren't answering your questions, like you really need to talk to a live person, you know, you there's a number you can call. If you call that phone number, uh, you're, you're not even, I mean, my experience is you don't even get like a busy signal. All you get is a recording saying that all lines are busy, please try again later. And so it's like impossible to, um, you know, talk to friends who've just sat there and redialed and redialed and redialed for hours, <coughs> excuse me, and, um, and been unable to get through. So um, the other way you can do it is you can send an email. Uh, I sent an email with a question uh, a while back and uh, it took three weeks for them to reply. So, you know, for those people that can't hang on for three weeks and really need their situation resolved, that may or may not work. I would recommend trying both of those, but here's another way. So you can go to UC Live Chat. So you click on that. And what happens here is you kind of get these weird, this weird screen. Uh, that looks like it was made in like 1996. But anyway, um, you'll see uh, these employer live chat options. Ignore that because you're not an employer. If you're trying to talk about like your unemployment benefits, it says select the chat, I the chat icon on the right, and then there's this arrow. So follow the arrow, and there you go. Tap type chat. All right. Now you got to put in your name and your phone number and the subject matter that you want to discuss. So if you want to talk about uh, your bi-weekly claims or whether or not you're eligible or how to file an appeal or what happens if they overpaid you and you don't want to get in trouble with the IRS or the Department of Revenue, you can, you know, all these different um, areas you can talk about um, or other, okay? So um, go ahead and put in your credentials. I'm gonna do that, but I'm not gonna um, record myself doing that. So. Um, and after you do that, press start chat, okay? So I'll pick it up from right there. And you're gonna see this, it says Paula is your virtual assistant, okay? Remember virtual assistant. Okay, all right, so once once you hit start chat, the automated assistant comes up and it says, hello, I'm Paula, your unemployment compensation virtual assistant. Are you an employer? If you are contacting about blah, 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 if you're, so please answer no, you're not an employer. So just type in no. Okay, now it'll it'll come back and it'll say, okay, and it, it says there was an issue. Uh, well, first it says, um, you know, work and update our systems. It says there was an issue. So if you're talking about that issue, they've already taken care of that. So just be patient. And then if you have a different question, it says, how can I help you today? So type in something like you didn't get your payment. Let's say you didn't get your payment. So say like help with payment and then hit enter and it'll say oh well you know if you need help with your payment you can go to the website and da 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 well yeah you can do that and, that and i recommend you do that but if you've already done that and you and you and this is not answering your question type in something else like uh no payment received And it'll come back and it'll give you another recommendation and then say something like uh, no email confirmation of claim. 
so type in three different things okay and then after you type in the third thing say um, transfer to real agent real agent okay so type in real agent and it'll say okay all of our agents so so here's the screen you're gonna get here's when the chats available okay and then it'll say we are experiencing higher than normal call volume or well chat volume so it'll be with you shortly and then I'll say all of our chat agents are busy assisting other customers so you have to keep doing this okay now you can it doesn't matter what you type in here you can type in okay and it'll start the whole process over okay and it says hi I'm your virtual assistant are you an employer no and then you answer another question and or you ask a question so you say like help payments and then you do it so you do that and then you say real agent and it'll come up with this again so if you keep doing this over and over I know it's it's a tedious process believe me I know um, eventually what will happen is you will get this screen and this bubble and then this bubble and it'll say a chat agent will be with you shortly and you won't have this bubble okay that all the agents are busy it'll just be this bubble and then that's it so when you get to, after you repeat this many times I think uh, I did it for about an hour before eventually and, and along the way I would get these, these two bubbles without this notification and then after about five minutes this notification would pop up and I'd have to go back and do the same thing you know start the conversation over again ask a question say uh, real agents you know just type in real agent but see it'll kick me back to the beginning of the conversation so if you type in real agent from the beginning of the conversation it'll say I know you want to speak with a real agent but let me try to answer your question first and so you say like uh, payments and then I'll say well this is what you do what else can I help you with you know you say claim and you'll say no payments and then you can say real agent now see what just happened it says we are experiencing a much higher than normal volume right here and it took a minute before it said that all these were busy so what will happen eventually is you'll get this statement right here and not this bubble here and you'll be in line for the next live agent and it does happen like I said when I tried to do it it took about an hour and uh, and then it took about another hour maybe half hour to 45 minutes to actually sort out what we needed to sort out so stay strong keep trying it at least it's an option that you have if you have some time because obviously if you're uh, trying to collect unemployment benefits you're not working as much as you used to if at all so you probably have time to do this in order to sort out um, what's going wrong with um, their automated system and you can tell by the interface here that the system is you know it's not the most technologically advanced system but anyway that's a way to get a real a real agent a real purse chat person chat agent in the chat as opposed to dealing with this kind of useless virtual assistant which has you know like 10 or 12 pre-programmed answers in it it seems that all refer you back to the website so uh, see if this works if this works for anybody please put it in the chat below or the comments below I should say <laughs> and uh, I hope this helps you um, uh, I, I was told this by a friend and uh, it helped me and then I've been able to help other friends with their uh, problems collecting their uh, unemployment claims and uh, you know uh, until we all get back to work here this is what we're gonna have to do I guess so um, yeah like I said if it helps you it helps you um, and if you guys are working out there God bless you thank you for for doing that and uh, you know some of us are working part-time some of us are working full-time 
uh, we're all trying to like scrape together, do whatever we can here. So let's help each other out and uh, see if you can help somebody today. It'll make you feel good. Take care.